Hello everyone, welcome back to BrainFlex. So in this video, we will see how to deploy an Angular application on Tomcat server. So before that, it's obvious that we should have an Angular project. So here we have a project on Angular internationalization. So let's see what it is. To run the application, we will use ng-serve command. This command will give us an URL for our server and on browsing that URL, we will see our project live on the browser. So we have localhost colon 4200 that is port number. So if we open this URL by just copy and paste it on the Chrome, we will see the Angular project running live. So this is the project of Angular internationalization. So this is a concept in which we translate the whole web page into some another language without redirecting to a new page. I mean on the same page as we know that Angular is single page application language or framework. Uh, so we have two ways to translate the whole page that is first copy the whole content and create a new web page of uh, that different language. So it will be hectic task. So here we are using some concept of Angular and you can see the translate tab has three different languages of English, French and Spanish. As we click on the French, the whole page will be translated into the French language in one click. Likewise, as we click on the Spanish, the whole page will be translated into the Spanish language. So let's not get into this detail. So what we want, we want to deploy the whole Angular project on our Tomcat server. For that, first locate your directory of your Angular application. Okay, I'm deleting this uh, DST folder. I will tell you what it is in the later video. Okay, so now the first question is why we need this? So as we see, the size of this whole project is more than 400 MB. So if we want to run this uh, project on some another system, we need to copy all these folders, copy all these files into that system. And again, we have to install all the dependencies in, the, in that system separately. And this will take a lot of time. So we have a solution. Like we know that Java is a platform independent language. So we will just convert all these files into JavaScript. So for that, we will follow these steps. So first, open the CMD command prompt and copy the path of your uh, project and just CD and paste it. And now you will be able to write the command from this directory. And here, just write down a command that is ng build hyphen hyphen base hyphen href equal to slash the name of your uh, project that is angular and uh, again slash and just press enter so what will this command do this command will create a dist folder as you can see here after the execution of this command and you can see the dist folder here and uh, let's see the size of our project now and that is uh, about 5 mb what happened just now so if we open this folder dist we will see a folder name as language that is the name of our project and as we open this folder we will see some java files js files and one html file the whole node modules json files and um, the model.ts all that angular files are now compiled and converted into js and html files so for that just copy this folder and locate your tomcat folder that is tomcat.9.o and in that in the web apps folder just paste it and uh, rename this folder as angular that we mentioned in the cli command and now just run the server and in the bin folder you will see tomcat9.exe just open that and as it open you will see this window and here you will get the port number of your server so just open the browser and go to this link that is localhost colon 8080 and you will see the apache home page and here we will just open our project that is angular so slash angular and now you can see the angular application is working fine on the tomcat server and the functionality of uh, those buttons are also working good that's it for this video and i hope this video was informative thanks for watching 
and if you are new here make sure you like this video and subscribe my channel brain flex and if you have any query you can contact me on instagram or mail me on my mail id or just comment down below and i will reply you as soon as possible see you in the next video good luck keep practicing goodbye